Hi, my name is Pastor Charlie Chimi. I'm the youth director here in Fonatu Eshte Mission. Recently, we've been hit by Cyclone Palm, which has devastated the, all of the regions here in Fonatu. Um, we have uh, experienced, we've never experienced such a cyclone um, in past years, and this is one of the worst ever cyclone that has hit our country here in Fonatu. As uh, we are looking forward to the Global Youth Day that is coming this coming Sabbath, the 20, 21st of March 2015. Um, unfortunately, our plan activities here for the youth here in Port Vila, um, we have planned to do great activities uh, around the communities here in, in, Port Vila, in Port Vila. But because of the cyclones, our youths have, have, have planned something for this coming uh, Global Youth Day to join together and, um, and assist and to, re and to provide relief to the communities, to the people that have been affected by this uh, cyclone that has uh, hit us. Um, we, we, the youth here in Fanatu, most of our young people are affected by the cyclone, but amidst, amidst the, the crisis that we are in, our youth here are uh, resilient in, um, in uh, coming together this coming Sabbath in, uh, in helping out in um, various ways that our youth here in Fanatu can uh, stay assist or to do with what is, what is had, had happened here in Fanatu. Um, um, for for this for this coming Sabbath um, for the global youth there, I would like to appeal to the global youth around the world, please to remember us in your prayers. Please to remember us in your prayers, and we do need the support to help our people here in Fanatu, and especially uh, our church families uh, that are affected by the cyclone that has just impacted our our nation and especially most of our jets have been affected most of our people have been evacuated to um, relief centers as um, as the government as the ngos as the donors are, here, are coming in to support those that are in need and and to assist with the crisis that this nation is going through so i'm appealing to the adventist youth around the world please do support us we need your prayers hi i'm uh, pastor nosteri uh, the president of vanuatu mission uh, as stated by our youth director, Vanuatu as a country has been devastated by the cyclone called Cyclone Bam. And uh, yesterday, the, the Prime Minister of uh, Vanuatu has declared uh, a state of emergency in, in, the, in the whole country. This is a cyclone that is, uh, has never been seen in the, in the history of Vanuatu before. This is a, a Category 5 cyclone. It is the strongest cyclone ever faced by the country. And uh, this, this is a disaster that is not only faced in some islands of Vanuatu, but the whole country. That's 83 islands, starting from the northern part of the country right down to the south. Impact has been felt throughout the country. Houses and homes, churches and schools have been devastated by the, uh, by the cyclone. Uh, as you will see in this short report, there are churches that is, uh, that is totally flooded by the cyclone. And, uh, uh, the communication network is down, uh, the, no internet, uh, no services at all in, in the country as, as, as at present. A lot of people are suffering, many people are flocking in evacuation centers, and uh, the ATRA uh, arm of the church, the, uh, the humanitarian arm of the church is working very closely with, uh, uh, with the National Disaster Office of this country, and they're coordinating the relief supply to many thousands of people in these evacuation centers. And as you can see at the background here, you can see the, uh, uh, the, the scene here in some parts of Port Vila and the homes that I'm standing in here. Many homes are like this, are devastated. Uh, plenty, plenty of people are now currently trying to put their lives back in order uh, as a result of this uh, great devastation that has taken place uh, in the country. And uh, at this uh, youth, National Youth uh, Day, uh, we are appealing for youths around the world to remember Vanuatu at this time in your prayers. And at the same time, I'm, I'm soliciting on behalf of, uh, of the church here in, in, the, in Vanuatu to actually ask and solicit for support in whatever way we can to rally up some kind of support to help us to put the lives of people and especially places of worship that has been very much devastated by this cyclone, not only here in Port Vila, where the capital city is, but also throughout the islands where we have thousands of our church members who are very much affected by uh, the, the, the great impact of this cyclone that has hit Vanuatu. Many people will eventually 
uh, we will have no fruits, no vegetables uh, on our table, maybe perhaps for the next six months. And so we tremendously would need a lot of support that would come from, uh, from our friends from abroad to help us with this, uh, with this great impact of the cyclone that had hit this country. And above all, we would like to solicit for your prayers. Pray for the people of God here in this country as uh, we're putting things back in order, putting the places of worship back in place, uh, and putting our lives back in place. We're asking your support uh, that God will, uh, will, will help the people as they put things back in order to support their livelihood. And so once again, on behalf of the Seventh-day Adventist Church here in Vanuatu, I wanted to say thank you. If you remember us in prayer and if you are thinking of supporting us, we do appreciate the help that you would give in this time of uh, great disaster. Thank you so much for the help that you will give to help us. Thank you.